Alright guys, so in today's video, I had an idea to make something that most people think is impossible. Roblox voice chat. Now you may be wondering how exactly I'm going to make it. Well, I'm going to use another voice chat platform that most people use, but I'm going to merge it with Roblox to create a proximity chat. This way, if you walk into a certain area in the Roblox game, you'll get to literally voice chat with people only in that area. I even tested it out with a few friends, and let me just say it worked perfectly. I'm going to show you exactly how I did it too, so if you want to add it to your own game, you can. Alright, enjoy. Alright guys so you guys already know what's happening in this video i am creating roblox voice chat and this is not a joke this is not clickbait okay i actually am doing this now let's not waste any time and i'm gonna get right started with this video all right so first things first we need to create zones that the players can walk in and out of so that way we can move the players to different voice channels whenever they actually do walk in and out of these zones all right so for now i'm just creating two basic zones called zone one and zone two and these are just for testing to see if this game actually is going to work and then later on we'll put it into an actual map with all the zones uh, correctly assigned all right so the first thing we need to do is just check to see if the player actually walks into a zone it shouldn't be too hard i just need to use like region threes all right so i'm pretty sure i got it working i added just a little bit of region threes in a loop to see if the player walks in the zone or if they're not in the zone all right so i put them both in a folder and added a little bit of code which basically checks to see if they're in the zone or not i also made a table to see if they've already been in the zone that way we don't spam the chat with saying they're in the zone again you know what i mean all right so we're gonna go to walk in the zone right now and see if this works and as you can see yes it says players walked into zone one players already in the zone players already in the zone all right perfect it's working literally exactly how i wanted to let me go walk into this zone and players have walked into zone two this is working great Great. Okay, exactly how I wanted to. I'm really happy right now. So now what we're gonna do, right, is I'm gonna create a Discord server, which is basically where voice chats can be created. Okay, and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna create a channel called Zone One, and I'm gonna create a channel called Zone Two. And whenever you walk into Zone One in Roblox, or you walk into Zone Two in Roblox, you'll get moved into the according channel, right? And that is basically a way you can make a proximity chat in Roblox. And you may be wondering how exactly am I gonna get Roblox to communicate with Discord, and that is through webhooks. Then I'm gonna have to create a whole discord bot to make the user get moved from zone one channel to zone two channel or whatever so that's gonna be really interesting to do honestly i don't have too much experience with discord bots but we're learning today okay <laughs> all right so i'm going to run a little bit of code to show you guys how webhooks work okay so as you can see it's not too much code but all i do is create a little message that is going to be sent from roblox to discord so i'm going to show you guys how that works real quick all right so as you can see we got our channel right here the discord's empty right but if i go ahead and hit play watch what happens okay okay never mind didn't work <laughs> all right, i forgot to uh, actually enable hpg requests so give me a second for that all right, now if I go ahead and play, this should work. So watch what happens, okay? Discord server's empty, and boom! Hello, this is a message from Roblox. Okay, this message was literally sent from Roblox, as you can see. It even says it right there. And this was the code that did it. It really wasn't much code at all, right? All I did was put in this little uh, code right here, and then send it through this little function right here. So now what I'm doing is I'm going to be creating a little command that's going to have the player's user ID, right? And the channel ID that they want to go to. And that will be the way I can actually get them to move to different channels. Then I'll actually have to create an actual bot that will actually be moving the Discord user to different channels but that'll come on in a little bit later all right so now i invited the bot to my server as you can see this is my bot right here uh i guess it kind of works okay it looks uh <laughs> it's offline i need to actually make it go online first but i have a bot that's good it's a good step now i'm gonna go ahead and start coding this bot and make it so i can actually do that command and it shouldn't be too hard actually because i'm using discord.py so it shouldn't be too bad all right, now it's been a little while, but as you can see, I got some code here. Now you might be wondering, does this work? But yes, this little code actually does make it so you can move the command, so you can move the user with the command, so that's nice. So I'm gonna go ahead and actually check out how it works right now. All right, so as you can see, I booted up my uh, my bot right here, and give it a second, it'll go online, and boom, it's online, as you can see. Uh, I like I like when that happens, it just feels so satisfying. All right, so now I'm gonna go ahead and paste the command. Now basically all it is, right, is it's uh, just the move thing right here, and this is my uh, user ID, so basically this is uh, this guy right here, and this is the channel I do want it to move it to. So pretty easy, nothing too crazy. So I'm gonna go and try that out right now and see if it works. And this is the moment of truth because if this works, then everything else will be pretty smooth sailing from here. So as you can see in three, two, one. Yo, it worked! Yes, 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 yes. Okay. Okay, so it, it did work. Um, that was actually pretty easy, honestly. I thought it was gonna be a lot harder. Now all we have to do is basically write a little bit more code on Roblox, which allows you to uh, basically, you know, get the user ID for the character, you know, put that in a table, and then put the user ID and put the channel ID with zones in a table, and then just match it up whenever you join it in the zone. It shouldn't be too hard, honestly. I'm gonna do that right now. All right, so as you can see, whenever um some, someone wants to be in the game, I'm gonna actually have to add them in manually. So for example, let's say you know Jim Bob wants to join, so we'll just say Jim Bob right here. I'm gonna actually have to get his Discord user ID. So I'm gonna have to actually know who's in the 
the game to actually have them in here, which is kind of annoying, but it is what it is. Nothing much I can do about that right now. And how you get user IDs, you just go to Discord and copy the ID right there, and then I would just paste it right there, and that would be that simple. So yeah. And then also, as you can see for the zones, this is just the channel ID. So I'll just go ahead and grab it from here if I want if I want to add another channel, and then I just paste it right there, and boom, there's a zone. So let's go and see if this works right now. Uh, moment of truth, moment of truth. <laughs> All right, so here we go, guys. If this works, then literally that essentially is almost voice chat and robots. Now I don't have anyone else here to test with me yet, so I don't know. I won't be the same, but that should be it. All right, so let's go and walk into the zone in three, two, one, and okay, it didn't work. <laughs> All right, it is what it is. Don't worry, I'm gonna fix it. It's been a little while, but I actually did get it working. Okay, now I don't know why it didn't work at first, right? But apparently the bot wasn't picking up on the what the webhook was saying, which is why it wasn't working. Now I don't know why I did that, but it just did. So I hit up my friend Yanku, and as you can see, I was asking him how I do it. I didn't really know what to do, and then all he did was just send me the piece of code. Literally, he's like, "That should work," and I was like, "Okay." He's like, "I'm like, where do I put it?" He's like, "Anywhere should be fine," and it worked. Okay, and then I was like, "Yo, I love you." It worked, <laughs> and then I sent those emojis, and he goes, "It's fine." No problem. All right, so perfect. Dude, shout out to this guy and shout out to Jared too. He helped me out a lot. All right, so watch. I'm going to go ahead and actually kill the bot real quick. All right, and as you can see, give it a second. The bot's back online. Perfect. Now I'm going to go and test this out again and let's see if this works. I know it honestly didn't work, but I just, I'm excited to show you guys, okay? Uh, we have it right here. All right, so as you can see, I'm just walking normally out here and I'm in zone two right now, but I'm going to go and walk into a different zone and boom, it worked. I literally just moved from that channel by walking in there. You guys saw that, right? I mean, literally the bot did it. So let's try it again. And it works. It works. It works. Yo, that is literally the best feeling ever. Okay, okay, okay. I need to sit down. <laughs> okay, okay. So, um... We got that working, honestly, a lot easier than I thought. And there's nobody in here to talk to me right now, but as you can see, I am talking and my, my little thing is turning green. But I need someone else to come test it out with me, so I'm going to do that in a little bit. What I want to do right now, though, is I'm actually going to go ahead and make a map where I can just add more zones and test it out with other friends, right? That way I can walk around in certain areas and it'll actually like, feel like actually immersive, you know what I mean? I'm going to do that right now. All right, so as you can see, I got the whole map set up, all right? Now, it looks kind of weird right now because I have all the zones uh, showing, but let me go ahead and hide them all for you guys. All right, so those are the zones, right? Now, I'm going to go ahead and make them invisible so you don't see them. But um, basically, whenever you walk into a certain part of the map you're gonna get moved into a different channel now uh i know it's gonna work so i'll go and test it out real quick just to show you guys but after i show you guys i'm actually gonna go to my friends and i'm gonna get the reactions on this and see what they think now as you can see i made some more voice channels here too so that's how that works all right so as you can see now we just walk in our zone right here and watch what happens boom we get moved into main street and let's go over here to the west side oh main street oh okay we're getting moved a lot okay all right i'm gonna chill out a little bit now <laughs> all right anyways that's how that works so yeah pretty cool all right so that works perfectly i'm gonna go ahead and hide all the zones and i'm gonna go ahead and actually go ahead and publish the game now and see my friends reactions i'm really excited to do this honestly all right i'm gonna go ahead and call them right now yo what's up bro yo what up my friend now what do you want <laughs> Okay, so uh, you know how I'm the Dev King. I already saw the last video. You were there. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I got something pretty cool for this video. I want to okay. see your reaction on it, okay? All right, what is it? Okay. Um, I don't want to say just yet. I'll explain to you when I'm in the game. Um, but first, <clears throat> I need to join the Discord server real quick, okay? All right. Uh, so you may be wondering why we're in here. There's only two people in the server. Well, actually four. Um, <laughs> but still, don't worry. Okay. <laughs> Another okay. suspicious. <laughs> All right, uh, I'm gonna link you the game and go ahead and join. Okay. All right. All right. Welcome. This is my place. Uh, now, what, what are your first impressions here? Honestly, it looks better than the last place. You actually <laughs> got buildings. There. Okay. Wait. 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 Wait a minute. Hold on. Oh, he moved. All right. I'm gonna go ahead and walk around a little bit and let's see what happens. All right. Let's go to Second Street. All right. Oh, wait for it. Yo, it actually moved me to the car. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, this is crazy. Yeah, so basically what I'm trying to make here is uh, Roblox voice chat. So if you go ahead and walk okay. into any area, what happens is it'll get moved. So go ahead and walk over to Main Street, and then I can I can wave goodbye to you, okay? I bet. Alright, and <laughs> there you go, he's gone. <laughs> like, now I can't talk to him. Oh, I forgot to enable bubble chat, but... Hello, Alpha 1! Like, he can't even hear me. Okay, it's a little bit buggy, but hey, you're back. Nah, this is actually lit. <laughs> yeah, so wherever I walk, it like takes me to that car. That's amazing. Exactly. We have four different zones. So would you consider that like Roblox voice chat kind of? Because obviously it's, you can't really make a voice chat in Roblox. It's kind of impossible, but this is like the closest I mean, you can get to it. Technically, it is Roblox voice chat. 100%. Yeah, it's like a proximity chat. Yeah, because the moment you step on the street, you can talk to everybody that's on that street. Exactly. So yeah, it is like Roblox voice chat. Imagine this in a game like the streets or whatever. Wouldn't that be sick? Yeah. This is actually so smart. I never, like, nobody ever came up with this. So this is <laughs> super smart. Hey, I'm like, glad wow. you like it, man. I'm glad you like it. Like, I, I don't even want to step on the street because it's going to teleport me to a different <laughs> car. That, that should be a zone too, but it's not working for some reason. But if you come over here, I'll take it to the west side. Hold on. Okay. 
yeah, see, now now he's in Main Street, and you, you walk through Main Street, and now you're in the West Side. Well, this is lit. What? I know, dude, I love it. All right, guys, I had to move to Main Street because he was talking too much. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. But uh, anyways, guys, that's the end of the video. I hope you guys did enjoy it. Be sure to smash the like button if you liked it. It really does help out a lot. And also subscribe, okay? 80% of the guys who watch my videos aren't even subscribed. Like, what are you doing, honestly? Just subscribe. You're missing out on so many good videos. And also be sure to use dark code tap whenever you buy premium or Robux. Helps me out a lot. And I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.